Did you know that the industrial organizational psychology was actually founded in the United States by the psychologist Hugo Munsterberg and Walter Dill Scott in the early 1900s? What exactly is industrial organizational psychology and what significance does it have in the field of psychology? Industrial organizational psychology is a subfield of psychology that applies psychological theories and principles to businesses. It is also known as I.O. psychology. I.O. psychology is the applied organizational psychology that uses a variety of scientific approaches to study, analyze, and understand human behavior in the workplace primarily how organization works and how employees perform. It generally focuses on enhancing and improving workplace productivity and its overall aim is to research and comprehend human behavior in the workplace. What does an industrial organizational psychologist do? Unlike the other types of psychologists, Industrial organizational psychology study and practice in areas such as analyzing jobs, selecting employees, determining salary levels, training, and evaluating employees. They also examine various methods and use existing or creating tests that can be used to train and develop employees, as well as in selecting and promoting them. They essentially use their scientific research in any types of organizational and workplace settings. I.O. psychologists also apply psychological principles and research methods in order to improve overall work environment and the employee's performance, communication, and productivity as well. Always keep in mind that I.O. psychologists are not specialized in diagnosing the mental diseases and do not dig deeply into the psyche of a worker, but rather examine personality traits and human behavior that pertains to a person's work. Where does an industrial organizational psychologist work? Now that you are aware what are the things I.O. psychologists perform, do you know where you can locate them? Where could their workplace be? I.O. psychologists have a lot of variety to decide where they could work, such as in colleges and universities where they work, research or hold academic positions, or in military units, or in sports teams and organizations. They may also work in an organization's human resources department, while others could also be qualified as trainers, facilitators, assessors, and consultants. They could even work as an independent consultant if they prefer it. They ensure that the organization utilizes its best human resources to its full potential and keep the organization together, which is crucial for their operations. They, number one, develop tests. Number two, recruit candidates best fit for their positions. Number three, build employee satisfaction. Number four, manage performance. And number five, train future leaders. In conclusion, industrial psychologists do their everything in their power to keep the organization together and realize its full potential. As seen in the testimonial, that job can be quite difficult but also rewarding and crucial. I hope you've learned something new from such valuable experience and consider these challenges and rewards that the field supplies you with. HR Senior Supervisor, I work and uh, I report and work uh, directly reporting to the Senior HR Director and the Senior and Director. My position is the HR for responsible in facilitating all the HR matters from recruitment or hiring the right talent for a specific position up to the next. Our we priority the onboarding and the training of our employees. So we also help our employees to be feel uh, to feel uh, that they are comfortable at the new. So we see to it that the employees are well informed about the things that they need to know about NU and their work as a whole. Of course, we follow the process that we have 
And most of all, we handle it with um, high confidentiality. Um, because HR is a profession that is ever-changing to make things better, I love helping employees reach and realize their full potential as a well-being and an advocate for diversity. So that would be all and thank you.